Don't come, come over here with that damn box. foolishness. Let something jump up out of this damn box. <laughs> <laughs> People are gonna love seeing this, and we, we don't really have a good, fun Halloween movie right now, do we? No, I haven't had one in a long time, so so this is really good. I'm, I'm really excited about it. It's something very different. I'm really excited about it. You always been a big Halloween fan? No, no, I'm not a witch's demon, gobbler, goobler kind of guy. Don't no, I pass on all of that. I don't don't scare me. Don't jump out. Don't do any pranks. I don't I don't play any of those games. Yeah, well, uh, well, what actually scares you though? Uh, the the very thought of being somewhere in a house and things are moving and noise and those kind of things. It doesn't scare me, it unnerves me, because mm -hmm. I'm a big man yeah. with ego. So I'm not scared, I'm just unnerved. Yeah. So there's a, there's a little there's a bit of a difference. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Uh, and so I guess you don't do the media costume just to throw people off every once in a while? What, like for they're Halloween or something? No, <laughs> never gonna happen. <laughs> or in life. Never gonna, no, never gonna happen. And I, I have enough of it doing it in, during these movies, so yeah. I have enough. Well, what made you uh, choose Halloween? Because I was the perfect setting. Chris Rock in uh, Top 5, he did this spoof called Boo a Medea Halloween. And when Lionsgate saw it, they thought, hey, we got to we gotta do that movie. So, and here we are. Well, what do you think you always remember about working on this? Because it seems like it was so much fun. It ain't fun. <laughs> I, I, it's fun when it's over and I can watch yeah. it with an audience and they enjoy it. But no, when, I, when I'm doing it, it's military precision. And when I have that costume on, man, I'm not a nice guy. It's it's so it's so uncomfortable. So I just it's about let's get it done so I can get out of this crap. There's got to be some good outtakes if you angry in the costume. Oh yeah, there's some hysterical outtakes. Yeah, yeah. Are we ever gonna see those? Nope, nope. No. They're locked away in a Tyler Perry vault. Well, and and you, speaking of the Tyler Perry vault, that's got to be such a nice thing to be so in control of everything that you do and so respected for what you do. It's got to be nice. You're running the show. It's a great it's a great feeling. It's a great feeling. I don't know about how much control I have over it at times, but it's it's a really, really great feeling to have so many people endeared to what I do. And what would you tell people who are looking up to you? Because I know there's a lot of people looking up to you right now. It's a tough business. Yeah, well, just listen, if you if you have something inside of you that you want to do, and you, you make it happen, and you don't have to follow the rules, because following the rules is only going to lead you to the door that everybody goes in. Find your own path is what I say. Last thing, why should we see this on the big screen? Because this country has got so much going on right now. Let's, let's just go and laugh. Let's just go take, take an hour, 45 hour minutes, and just laugh your head off and just get lifted. So that's what this is about for me. Help me, Jesus! Help me, Jesus! Help me, Jesus! Tyler Perry's Boo, a Medea Halloween.